A Tesla burns underwater when submarine mode fails. It was an incident that happened when a Tesla was launching a jet ski at a boat ramp. And while doing research for this incident, I found two other incidents that happened the same way. We got some underwater fireworks going on right here. Now, I'm always a little bit skeptical when I see these videos claiming to be EV failures that circulate around the internet. So I did some digging, and it turns out this one actually was an EV. This was a Model X that was backing a jet ski into the water. Unfortunately, something failed that Model X rolled into the water, submerging itself completely. It ended up failing, the battery went into thermal runaway under the water. And what you're seeing here is the battery's off-gassing a lot of flammable gases. Those gases are burning above the water. Now the battery's probably burning under the water as well because again, these batteries don't need oxygen from the outside atmosphere to burn. Now this happened at the Polk Street boat ramp in Hollywood, Florida. And when firefighters arrived, they decided to allow that car to burn underwater until the thermal runaway was complete. Once the thermal runaway was complete, they pulled that vehicle out of the water, they loaded it up on a tow truck, and they actually had an apparatus follow that tow truck to the salvage yard, which is actually a very smart idea because having that vehicle on top of the tow truck after it's been submerged in salt water, you can have a secondary fire, you can have a reignition inside of that battery. You don't know for sure, did that battery burn all the way through, burn through all the lithium ion batteries prior to coming out of the water? Now, while I was researching this incident, I found two other incidents that were very similar. They both involved salt water, electric vehicles, and a runaway car going into the water. There's a lot of Tesla owners out there that tow boats. Now, as you can imagine, this could be a very large issue, especially when you start talking about salt water. And you can see as this Tesla has just dropped off its boat, it's coming up the ramp, there's a lot of water being drained out of the undercarriage of that vehicle. That is not good for the batteries. That's not good for all the components underneath that vehicle. That salt water will get in there and just start corroding things and tearing things up. Ends up being a very large risk for fire eventually down the road. The first incident I found involved another Model X. It was backing a boat into the water. That vehicle went into the water, submerged, and caught on fire. The batteries went into thermal runaway under the water. Now eventually they were able to remove that vehicle from the water get it on a tow truck and get it out of the marina. The battery box in an electric vehicle, it is watertight. However, there's vents in the sides of these battery boxes to allow the box to breathe with differences in atmospheric pressure. Once you completely submerge a vehicle in water, very good odds that that ventilation system is gonna fail and allow water into the box. Once you get salt water in the box, you're gonna corrode and start shorting things out in the battery, and that's what causes the battery going to thermal runaway. The next incident happened near Vancouver, Canada. In this case, the owner was unhooking his boat when his vehicle suddenly took off. Oh my goodness. Okay, now we gotta go help him. Stop, but sorry, funny. Now the driver was extremely lucky he wasn't run over. Unfortunately for us, the cameraman, his wife made him put that camera down, turn it off, stop recording. Ma'am, that was funny. But when his vehicle went into the water, it was submerged. The Port Moody Fire Department showed up. Eventually, they got that vehicle out of the water. But when they got that vehicle out of the water, the battery went into thermal runaway. This was another situation where salt water caused a failure with a lithium ion battery. This SUV was a Mitsubishi Outlander. It was a plug-in hybrid vehicle. So it still did have that large lithium ion battery. If you're interested in learning more about thermal runaway, Click this video right here. That'll teach them for owning a jet ski. Wank